Oh, we'd only see. That is not going to keep him away. He's not a demon. What is he then? A pain in my ass, that's what he is. Oh. Please, tell me what's going on. If only you'd taken me more seriously last night. girlfriend. My... Oh, no, no, nothing like that. Oh, all right. She was a client. Oh, all right, no more questions asked. Not like that. No, whatever you say. It's a delicate situation. Like I said, no more questions from me. No. I'm a ghost hunter. <laughs> turn left after the next right. Uh, I thought I turned the sat nav off. Make a left turn and return to your initial location. That's weird. Return to your initial location. Stop the car. Now, look, I didn't mean to breathe. Stop the car. Really, I didn't mean to affect Stop! you. Stop! this in the back of the car. What do you think? Oh, wow. It's very pretty. Mm. You know, my mother used to tell me that these type of shells would hold restless souls. <laughs> yeah, your mom believed a lot of things. <laughs> yeah. How would you sleep? Very well, thank you. Mm. <laughs> I'm exhausted. Go on, get to work. All right. Love you. Bye. Take me back. <laughs> Very unprofessional. You know, back in my day, cab drivers were much more punctual. Return to your initial location. Well, listen to the man. Take me back. You are a cab driver, after all. And considering my condition, I don't really have to pay a fare, do I? You have to help me. This has been going on all day. He won't leave me alone. It sounds like him. Absolute control freak. 
What does he want? The girl I was with last night, it's her father. They didn't have a great relationship. Said she hadn't seen him in years. Then all of a sudden he's bitten the dust and can't get enough of his daughter. So you're telling me your father is haunting you? Yes. By cleaning your house and cooking you dinner? In short, yes. It's not exactly the most terrifying case I've been on, if I'm being honest. <sighs> okay, listen, I haven't seen this guy since I was 10 years old, and now it's like I have an overprotective parent micromanaging my life. Drinking. All right, and you're listening to AFTR Life in the Morning. And according to the laws in the state of Nebraska, citizens must be 21 years or older in order to consume alcohol. Are you serious? It didn't stop there. This went on for weeks. Shell, you found it? Oh, yes. And you didn't bring it here, did you? Of course not. Good. Shell is like his talisman. Every time he appears, it's there. I, I thought I got rid of him, and then the sat nav started speaking, and then I found the shell in my pocket. I thought I said the incantation properly. He burst a light bulb, and it, it distracted me. He must have followed me. Into my Uber. Listen, I didn't what realize. What does he want? Oh, I don't know. To torment his daughter? They didn't speak. He... You lied. What? You brought the shell. You brought him here. <laughs> what do you want? Oh, I don't know. A uh, cappuccino? A little light chocolate dusting? You shouldn't be here. I think we both know the solution to that problem. From ashes to ashes and dust to dust. Oh, that feels a little bit weird. Restless soul, wandering specter, howling ghoul be banished. Oh, now there's a tingling in the fingertips. Oh, now I got bad pins and needles. What are you doing? Are you hurting him?
Zo! Zo! Wait! 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 All this time. I thought you were working late. And then um, you come home and sleep during the day. We don't even spend time together anymore. And now, you're with another no, woman! No, I'm not. I'm <laughs> you got some real explaining to do. You can't even explain yourself! Come on, man. What are you doing? Shut up! How dare you talk to me like no, that? No, not you. It... Oh, here she is. The hussy. Excuse me? Homewrecker! Who are you? I'm his wife. Well, I'm his exorcist. Look, look. Hey, guys, remember me? The ghost? <laughs> Do you even know what kind of trouble you're causing? You don't even know us. And your poor daughter, God, you're tormenting her. Jeez, ow. You are an evil man. Well, that's a bit harsh. Maybe you should just forget about me again, you homewrecker. You know what? I saw the two of them kissing. What? Oh, stop lying. You know, a minute ago, I was willing to try to help you. I should have just let her exercise you. No. Uh, wait. Just wait. He's a ghost? Yes. Wait. A talisman of the restless souls. He hasn't finished business. Oh, no, we are not helping him. He's tormented me for long enough. We have to, or he'll never move on. Well, here we are. What? Don't look at me. I'm not going to go in there. Well, the last time I did that, I got the, I got the discount exorcist called on me. Discount exorcist, my ass! So what are we going to do? Uh, we're going to plan B. No, no, absolutely not. I drove you here, but I am staying in the car. Hi, uh, we're here about the light. That's a lot of boxes. Are you moving? Yeah, I just need a change of scenery after everything. Oh. <clears throat> I'm sure Daniela filled you in. Right. Shema, uh, there is something that I've been meaning to tell you. What? Um... It, it doesn't matter. Oh, okay. <laughs> Do you need a ladder? Oh, yeah, sure. It's not going to work. I'm sorry. What else are we going to do? Well, there's only one other option. What? Do it. Through the power and the might, transfer the soul into the vessel of life. What's going on? This might feel a little weird. For the completion of unfinished business, for the restless soul to find rest, let this vessel before us be possessed. Gemma, that's my stuff. Do you still like the beach? What? Because I think that's what I miss most, not being around anymore, except in mirrors. And what I could say I miss the most was the uh, salty air or the surf or the sun, which you will never convince me caused the cancer. It must have been all those smoked meats. But what I miss the most are those summers there with your mom and you, us. And that one time where you found this thing and I promised you you could have it on your 18th birthday. We pinky promised, remember? I didn't even send you a card. Dad? How 
help. No. It's not haunted. At least it won't be anymore. I want you to have it. Some kind of psychic? No, I'm... I'm just the Uber driver. No, don't be silly. Thank you. It's over? It's over. This has been an eventful day. I think I'm going to look for a new job. One with more sociable hours. Really? Does this mean I'm going to get my husband back? <laughs> exactly. I'm not going to waste any more of the time we have. 